Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we will study about raw materials used for culture media. Raw materials used for culture media. One is the beef extract. This is an aqueous extract of lean beef tissue ka, that is concentrated to a paste. If we talk about nutritional value, this is a water soluble substance of animal tissue which has carbohydrates bhi hote hai, aur organic nitrogen compounds bhi, and water soluble vitamins and salts as well. Peptones. It is the product of digestion of protein. Aceous materials, example meat, casein with acids or enzymes are also available in this. Depending upon the protein used and method of digestion, different peptones are available. These differ in the ability to support the growth of bacteria. If we talk about the nutritional value, it is the principal source of organic nitrogen. Vitamins and sometimes carbohydrates are also present depending upon the protein digested. Agar, it is a complex carbohydrate obtained from certain marine algae. It is the sulfated polymer of D lactose plus 3,6 and hydroalkyl lactose plus D glucuronic acid. It is a non nutritive solidifying agent for the media. When temperature is reduced below 45 degrees Celsius, it is dissolved in aqueous solution or gels. Yeast extract It is an aqueous extract of yeast cells. It is available as powder. Nutritional value It is a rich source of B vitamins. It is having organic nitrogen and carbon compounds. Composition of nutrient proof and nutrient agar. Beef extract 3 gram in nutrient proof, peptone 5 gram, water up to 1000 ml. And in nutrient agar, beef extract 3 gram, peptone 5 gram, agar 15 gram, and water up to 1000 ml. Culture media. It is a solid or liquid preparation that is used to grow transport and store the microorganisms. Types of media. There are four types. General purpose media, selective media, and risk media, and differential media. Types of media. General purpose media is that which support the growth of many microorganisms. Example, triptych soy root and triptych soy agar. Second one is selective media that favors the growth of particular microorganisms. Example, Macron ke agar used for detection of E. coli and suppress the gram positive bacteria growth. And this media that is, blood and other special nutrients are added to the media to grow fast radius heterotrophs. Blood agar is its example. The last one is differential media that is used to distinguish between different groups. Example, blood agar is used to differentiate between hemolytic bacteria and non-hemolytic bacteria. Hemolytic bacteria example are streptococci and staphylococci. Macron ke agar differentiate between lactose fermenter and lactose non-fermenter. Thanks for watching my video. Please like share and subscribe my channel for the latest updates stay tuned with my channel by clicking the bell icon if you have any query then please write it in the comment box you can also suggest the topic for the video in the comment box